gets a farm to school a month here uh, across the nation in Greenville County Schools. We have an absolutely fabulous project uh, that came our way. Our partners at Feed and Seed of Greenville, which is a food aggregator and producer here in the upstate, came to us uh, with a farmer who was greatly impacted by Hurricane Helene uh, and had no distribution for 600 pounds of fresh, beautiful, hydroponically grown basil. We put a recipe together quickly. Feed and Seed uh, piloted that recipe for us. And then we enlisted some of our partner districts, uh, Lawrence 55, Lawrence 56, Spartanburg School District 6, Anderson School District 5, Pickens County and Union County Schools have all joined us uh, as we are going to produce this nut-free pesto uh, and distribute it for use in our menus. And today we get to visit the farm. We're here at Tiger River Farms at their amazing greenhouse where they grow fresh lettuce and basil year round. We are really lucky to get together and have an amazing collaboration between their farm, Feed and Seed, Greenville County Schools, and six other school districts that are able to utilize basil for an amazing fresh local pesto that we're going to be putting on our menus and serving to students across seven school districts. Hello, my name is Ryan Oates, and I'm the owner of Tiger River Smart Farm in Reedville, South Carolina, and we are um, working with Feed and Seed in some of the, the area schools, including Greenville County Schools, on uh, processing some of the basil that we grow into pesto. We grow lettuce and basil, and uh, about half of what we grow is basil, about half of what we grow is lettuce. We started growing in 2012 and built this uh, facility in 2016, so we've been in this facility for the past eight years. My name is Adam Sturm. I'm the Director of Operations for Feed and Seed Co., a nonprofit located in Greenville, South Carolina. Uh, we do uh, a lot of the processings and try to make that connection between local small farms and institutions. Um, today we're here at Tiger River Smart Farm where we are able to um, purchase some excess basil that Ryan had and turn it into a nut-free pesto, which we're um, getting into the school districts within the upstate of South Carolina. October is Farm to School Month, and I can't think of a better way to utilize fresh local ingredients and serve our community and our students. It's a win-win-win for all. <laughs>